Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you all are doing all great. So I am Sharmili and you are watching Sharmili Bing Bengali on YouTube. So I am doing a review of these two things right over here. And if you guys want to know what I feel about these two things, then please keep on watching. These are the Maybelline uh, V Face Duo Stick by Face Studio, and this is the V Face Blush Contour Palette. So Maybelline has recently launched these uh, two things and also some other things, but I bought only these two things. So I have used this contour shade and the blush shade onto my face today, and I will show you the demo at the end. So yes, and this one is. This one is priced at rupees 550, and this one is priced at rupees 699. I guess so. I will link it in the. This one is priced at rupees 650, and you get in this one you get four gram of product, and in this one you get eight gram of product, which is really nice. I really like the content of this products, and according to the price range, these ones are really com uh, like you know affordable to buy, not that costly or high end things like Maybelline is a drugstore brand come on it cannot make any high end things but the pricing is really good so at first i'll talk about this one this is the v face duo stick so you just open from this side this side this one has this highlighter side and this one has this contour side so highlighter i'll talk about the highlighter at first is that this one is really pigmented very much creamy gives you a nice subtle glow onto your face i hope you guys can see the glow over here gives a really nice glow onto your face if you want you can obviously layer it up but i didn't i just used a single swipe or two swipes of this and i was good to go it blends like a dream it blends really nicely now i will just talk about uh, about this contour shade so this contour shade is very much creamy and the problem is the pigmentation i personally don't like the pigmentation at all product i would say the product itself is not applicable or good or it won't show up onto the darker skin tones or to the, to the medium toned skin tones like me like i think you can understand that this shade is uh, three four shades or five shades darker than my skin tone the pigmentation is really bad i would say the pigmentation is real bad and but the product itself like the uh, formula of the product the formula of the product is really good like it blends like a dream it's just so creamy it won't create any dry patchy thing onto your face this is what it looks like yes this is what it looks like and yes so next i will be talking about this v face uh, blush contour palette i hope you guys can see that this has this v and three different shades over here so let me open without chipping my nail so yes and this one comes with a brush like so the brush which is really thick and good for contouring which i really like i would say that these three shades are really uh, creamy not creamy like blendable they are so soft and they're nice it just blends onto your skin i have used the um, blush shades i have just swirled my brush onto it and i just use it onto my face but the only problem is that um, this one is really powdery like if you just dip your brush and it just the powder will be everywhere like everywhere and i don't like that yes i'm in the shade peach the instructions are given over here like so so yes this is the short review of uh, these two products and if you want to see the demo then watch it now so my full face is done only uh, contour and blush is left for me so first i will be using this maybelline v face duo stick so at first i will be using this um, contour side right now i will just contour my face Can you see the line of it? These ones are extremely creamy. I have just arched the line at first and then I will just take my buffing brush and I will just blend it. You can see 
see that this one blends really well this one is really very much creamy very nice but not that much pigmented as i thought it would be it just creates a nice shadow if you want you can layer it out i will actually layer it out with that I'm just blend it with my hand, let's see. This one is not that much pigmented. I just use it onto the temples of my face, onto the sides of my nose. Uh, I don't know, I'm very bad at contouring my nose, but let's try it can you guys see any kind of difference I just cannot see because I think that this one uh, is just two three shades lighter sorry darker than my skin tone I'll just use this highlighter shade now Ooh, the highlighter is really pigmented I would say you just need a little bit of the highlighter and you get that subtle glow onto your face. I like to use like blend it with my fingers rather than brush because I haven't tested it. This is the first time I'm trying and this is the first impressions video and with brush I don't know whether I'll be messing it out or not so I thought of using my fingers rather than any kind of brush so next i'll be using this v face blush contour uh, by face studio thing blush contour palette this one is not yet open i will just open it right in front of you okay and i will chip my nails guys this one has this peachy blush this one has this nude color of a shade and this one is a contour shade I will show you the swatch of these three at first hardly can be seen hardly hardly you guys can see and I'm so much depressed I think my money is all in waste I like the cutting of the brush this has this curved cutting which I really like so I just and it's just easier to apply your contour as well so I'm just contouring my nose with the same brush now I will just apply blush so for that I will just swirl my brush from three of the colors like so and I'll apply it onto my cheeks the blush, the blush gives a nice uh, peachy glow which I really like. This one really gives a peachy glow onto your face uh, and very much powdery guys. Oh my god. So the blush color is uh, nicely pigmented. I don't want bloom bloom kind of peachy things onto my cheeks. I really like subtle blushes as you guys uh, know if you follow me for the longer time. So I really like peachy uh, corally nice subtle blushes. So the blush is ideal for me and the contour shade is really quite good which I have is this contour stick. I am not at all happy with this contour stick. So that's it about the review of these two things right over here. I hope you guys have liked it. And I really like this blush contour uh, palette rather than this stick. So please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And see you guys in my next video. Till then take care. Love you. Bye bye.